and lovely volunteers. And as you can see, we've made life very easy for you. Look, we have all the ingredients there laid out, even weighed out for you. So really and truly, it couldn't be more simple. <coughs> We're going to start with the soda scones. This was the treat, the Sunday treat. And it began when dry food became available in Ireland, which was at the end of the 1800s. And of course, the Minochi, the ladies of the house, even though they kept the hen's eggs for their pin money, so they could buy their hat pins, they reserved one egg a week to make the nice curly bread. And that was very special. And there was a bit of sugar in the curly bread as well. And that mostly didn't get a chance to even get cold because when it came out of the oven, it was eaten with the hot buttery um, yes, butter dripping down on it. So we're going to look at very basic ingredients. Um, soda bread has actually five ingredients. There's white flour, brown flour, butter, milk, bread, soda and salt. Just five ingredients. But the luxurious curly bread has sugar and currants and an egg. So three extra ingredients. So if you look around, you can see you've got your um, Flour, white flour, cream flour, that's the name of it, cream flour. And like Mary said, we don't grow a lot of flour in Ireland because we don't get much sunshine. But the flour we do grow is very, it's blended because we import quite a bit, so it's a mixture. Um, we have some oats here, we're going to sprinkle those on top to give it a bit of a crunch. We've got the raisins, you could put sultanas, currants, to my mind, should be banned from the face of the earth. I don't <laughs> like them, but that's another story. Um, buttermilk. Now, we're, look, we're using this quignog buttermilk, which is made locally. It's absolutely delicious. And I know it sounds like product placement and I'm pushing it, but I used it last night. And I think you, those of you that tried those scones, it does make a superior scone. Um, I actually drank it and it tastes lovely. And people long ago used to drink it. It was very, very healthy, extremely healthy, and the complexion exactly. They they wash their faces in it um, as well. And we have an egg. So what I'm going to get you to do, folks, is this is your flour. You're going to tip your flour into the bowl and sieve it with the salt. So you get a pinch. Do you know what a pinch is? Yeah. Well, I'll show you a pinch, John. It's what you can fit. Married. It's what you can fit. <laughs> between your thumb and your thing. So a nice pinch of salt in with your flour. So pass it around there. And this is your bread soda. This is the, the very powerful chemical. Do you remember what Mary said? Native American Indians, isn't that fascinating? They came up with the idea of using bread soda. Get the lumps out and put it in with the flour. Joe is going to this. Joe thinks this is a race now, but that's fine. <laughs> I just want to get out of here, right? Surrounded by women. Give it a good save on the bread soda and the salt. A pinch of salt, people. Good. Yeah, yeah, that's fine. Yeah. You've done this before, is it? Oh, yeah. Looks yeah. like a dead hand at it, yeah. Yeah, very good. Flour. Here you go, love. I have it done. You have your flour. And your bread soda. Yeah, and your salt. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, my God, you're wonderful. <laughs> now. Next goes the sugar. Sugar, can you find the sugar? Here we go. And your sultanas or raisins. And give that a stir. Yeah, tip them in. Now. Okay, have a look now at the butter. Have a look at the butter. You see I've divided it into nines. So I'm going to give each of you one little. Just mix it up there. Mix up the butter. Mix it up. You can rub it in with your fingers. Rub it in. Yeah. Rubbing in. Rubbing in. Don't overdo it. Just a little bit. Just a little bit. Yeah, by hand. You want to put your hands in there now in a minute. Lovely. Lovely. Mix it in now with your hands. And you should put it around. <laughs> Are you used to this, Joe? Have you done this before? I, I, no. I, I did you get your in, busher, I Jamie? I walked in one time in no. West Cork, and I went down Rubbish there early, and um, there was an old woman with a hotel at West Lodge every day, and she was 90, and every morning she came in, and she'd make a homemade brown bread for the hotel. That's all she did. She was 90. 
and she actually gave me the recipe and I still have it. Have you? Yeah. Uh, yeah. And every morning the two of us have been there at 8 o'clock making the brown bread. And the old, same as this. It was fascinating. That's going back 40 years ago and I still, still have it. So you got an advantage, yeah? Well, we don't know what the advantage is. We'll, we'll, we'll see how, this, how, it, how, it, how it works towards this one. Break your egg into your buttermilk. Break your egg into your buttermilk. Oh, you're still not breaking eggs with a choice. Oh, one handed, one handed trick here. What does the egg do for it, Joe? No. The egg thing it holds it all together, Ali. It gives a bit of flavour as well. It, holds, it, binds, it binds it all together. So you can do with it. That's lovely. No. Hold back. Now, can I just say, hold back about a teaspoon. Because you don't, you don't always know how much liquid the, egg, the flour is going to take. Mm. So just hold back a teaspoon and pour the rest in. Don't worry about it. Now mix it with your hand there. Good. Open out your hand. Is that the way you do it, Joe? Yeah, do you want yeah. a spoon? No, no, friend. Open out your hand. Are you making bread or a scone now? We're doing a scone. Scone, look. Scone, Get your hand in there. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
Come on, don't tell me no, you didn't do this before. Me? Yeah. Oh, I don't know. Yeah, then. Oh, definitely. Yeah, oh, yeah, yeah. No, no, no. I think he's cheating. Oh, yeah, I'm watching. Oh, yeah. I had my eye in him. Don't worry. Yeah, you, should, you, should, you should have to play the music tonight. Yeah. Background, yeah. yeah. <laughs> I think the sound is so nice because it's easier. The hair gone, yeah. Okay. Give me the zoo. The black family sing something. It's revolutionary. You don't, you don't want people taking credit for the better looking score. Off the rows, yes. ah, they could be, be terrible. Any other way. Jenny, how are you getting on? Doing very well. How's Joe doing here? He's gone. Now we can get him on this team here, Jenny. Jenny, I'll get you a team. How long will it take to cook them now? About 20 minutes, they'll do ones, I'd say. 20 minutes. Yeah. Yeah. They're so small, they should, yeah, 20 minutes. Is there a set temperature for them or? Yeah, every oven is different on it. The yeah. confector oven, the oven, the oven, the oven the, you, you get to know your oven, it's like a woman. You know, it's hot, it's too hot, you're in trouble. Hot you're in trouble as well. Do we know who's the Yeah, yeah. No, I want to see no, the you want to win the prize. Oh, I'll tour this and then you know the other ones on that. Oh, what's that? Absolutely brilliant, Sean. They all came together. Now put a little bit of egg on the top. Yes, of course I put egg on my shoulder. Sure, the woman looking over your shoulder there. She's all the women looking over my shoulder. There we go. It's a story of my life. Yeah, you know about your shoulder. Right, we're off. Okay. Are you in love, are you? Only at the weekends, Ali. Only at the weekends. <laughs> years. How many years? Well, oh, you have great patience. She's been in love. Give me a kiss. Oh, lovely. What are we going to say, Joe, anyway? I'm fired your building. How are you getting me? Are you well? He's filming. He, 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 he looks like he looks like an inspector, Joe. Yeah. Yeah. He, if you had them to, 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 She's going to mix them up with somebody else. The way, she, the way she's going on, right? She mixes up, yeah. And you lose the prize. Yeah. yeah. Of course. Yeah. Joe, how's the apron fitting on? Is it all right, yeah? I've got the mid now. you got the mid, have you? Oh, they're gone, are they? Oh, well, yours gone. Yours gone. Who's the boss in your house? Who's the boss in your house? Yeah, I kind of knew that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's pretty much the norm, isn't it? <laughs>